Recent discoveries have revealed a stunning cosmic pairing, sun-like stars orbiting black holes. These systems, Gaia BH1 and BH2, were identified by the Gaia mission and challenge our understanding of stellar evolution. Unlike typical black hole binaries, which feature close, intense interactions, these systems have sun-like stars orbiting dormant black holes at wide separations, an arrangement previously thought unlikely. In this video, we'll dive into the details of these discoveries, explore the science behind their formation, and discuss what they reveal about the universe and its most enigmatic objects. Gaia BH1 and BH2 are unlike most known black hole binaries, which typically involve massive stars or compact remnants like neutron stars in tight orbits. What sets these systems apart is their sun-like companion stars, main sequence stars with masses, luminosities, and temperatures similar to our sun. This feature alone challenges conventional models of stellar evolution and binary dynamics. Gaia BH1 is located approximately 1,560 light years away in the constellation Ophiuchus. It features a black hole companion about 10 times the mass of the Sun, with a Sun-like star orbiting at a distance similar to the Earth's distance from the Sun, completing one orbit every 185 days. Meanwhile, Gaia BH2 is situated farther away, but follows a similar pattern, with its companion star displaying comparable properties. These wide orbital separations are particularly intriguing, as they sharply contrast with the close orbits seen in most other known black hole binaries, where intense gravitational interactions often dominate. The identification of these systems relied on subtle observational techniques. Unlike black holes actively accreting material, which emit X-rays and are easier to detect, the black holes in Gaia BH1 and BH2 are dormant. This means they emit no detectable radiation, making them invisible through conventional observational methods. Instead, astronomers use data from the Gaia mission, which measures the precise positions and motions of stars across the galaxy. By analyzing the minute wobbles in the motion of the companion stars, researchers inferred the presence of massive, unseen objects exerting gravitational influence. These turned out to be black holes. Follow-up observations using ground-based telescopes, including the Gemini North Telescope in Hawaii, confirm the nature of these systems. Spectroscopic analysis provided insights into the orbital dynamics and helped estimate the masses of the black holes and their stellar companions. This multi-step approach highlights the power of combining space-based and ground-based observations to uncover hidden cosmic phenomena. The relatively quiet nature of these two black holes allows scientists to explore binary dynamics without the interference of high energy processes like accretion, offering a clearer view of the underlying mechanics. These systems also hint at a potentially large, yet undiscovered population of dormant black holes, paired with sun-like stars in the Milky Way, challenging our understanding of black hole demographics. Traditionally, when a massive star exhausts its nuclear fuel, it collapses in a supernova explosion, often ejecting any nearby companion or consuming it during its final stages of expansion. Yet, the stars in Gaia BH1 and BH2 have survived this process. This anomaly points to a unique formation mechanism, distinct from standard models. One plausible explanation involves the mass loss experienced by massive stars before they collapse into black holes. As these stars evolve, they shed significant amounts of material through intense stellar winds. This gradual mass loss can prevent the star from expanding to a size that would engulf its companion. Furthermore, it reduces the violence of the eventual supernova, allowing the companion star to remain in its orbit. This scenario requires a delicate balance. The stellar winds must be strong enough to strip the star's outer layers, 
but not so intense as to disrupt the binary system entirely. Another possibility is that these systems formed through dynamical interactions in dense star clusters. In such environments, gravitational encounters between stars and stellar remnants are frequent. A black hole could capture a sun-like star during one of these interactions, forming a binary system. This dynamical capture scenario could explain the wide orbital separations observed in Gaia b, H1, and BEH2, as such interactions often lead to loosely bound pairs. Computational models and simulations have been instrumental in exploring these formation scenarios. By simulating the late stages of massive star evolution, Researchers have identified conditions under which a companion star can survive the collapse of its partner into a black hole. These models emphasize the importance of factors like the mass ratio between the stars, the strength and duration of stellar winds, and the initial orbital configuration. Observational evidence supports both formation scenarios. For instance, studies of massive stars in binary systems have shown that significant mass loss through stellar winds is common, particularly in stars with initial masses exceeding 30 times the sun's mass. Similarly, observations of dense star clusters have revealed numerous binary systems formed through dynamical interactions, suggesting that such processes are not uncommon. The discovery of Gaia BH1 and BH2 has profound implications for astrophysics, challenging long-held assumptions about black hole binaries. One immediate realization is that dormant black holes paired with sun-like stars may be far more common than previously thought. The Gaia mission has already identified these two systems, and researchers estimate that hundreds more may exist within its dataset. These findings suggest that the Milky Way could harbor a vast, hidden population of dormant black holes awaiting discovery. Supporting this breakthrough are several pivotal studies. In 2022, El Badri and colleagues demonstrated how precise analysis of Gaia data could uncover sun-like stars orbiting black holes, validating the observational techniques used to identify Gaia BH1 and BH2. Another study by Chakrabarti and his team explored the dynamics of such binary systems, providing theoretical support for their formation through mass loss in stellar winds or dynamical interactions in dense star clusters. Earlier, in 2019, a landmark study titled Properties of Black Hole Binaries in the Milky Way highlighted the potential of astrometric data to detect dormant black holes. It showed that even invisible black holes could exert measurable gravitational effects on nearby stars, offering a method to uncover previously undetectable binaries. This research laid the groundwork for identifying systems like Gaia BH1 and BH2. These discoveries also have implications for gravitational wave astronomy. Binary systems involving black holes are significant sources of gravitational waves, and understanding their formation is crucial for interpreting signals from observatories like LIGO and Virgo. While Gaia BH1 and BH2 may not merge within a Hubble time due to their wide separations, their existence refines models of black hole mergers and the distribution of compact binaries in the galaxy. Thank you for watching, and stay curious. There's always more to discover in the universe. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends who love exploring the cosmos. We'd love to hear your thoughts, so leave a comment below and let us know what you found most intriguing. Until next time, keep looking up and exploring the wonders of the universe. See you in the next video.